right, let's see where we are. What is this place? Looks all fancy. We got some glow bugs, some fancy stuff going on. Mm hmm. Interdurasting. So, guys, welcome to Ark Aberration. Now, I want to start off this video by saying, one, you're going to find the IP to my own Aberration server hosted by Nitrato in the comment section of this video. Join in. I'm currently recording there, actually, and doing some stuff, so maybe I'll say hi to you or something. I don't know. We can hang out after I'm done my stuff. Either way, in this video, I have some stuff I want to do. So, first off, the map is absolutely gorgeous on Aberration. And what I want to do, I think, is... Oh, this is where the stream area was, actually. Yeah, this is where they had the stream stuff. And the Reaper Queen was spawned down here. I, think, I don't think she's actually down in this area anymore. But the giant crabs are here. This actually, yeah, this place is actually really beautiful. Now, I don't know if she's still here or not. I'm not even sure of the exact location of the Reaper Queen, if she is still down here. But I do know I want to try and get to the surface of Aberration because I'm curious to know what is up there, if anything is even worth going up there to look for. Now, this place is gorgeous. Now, a lot of this, too, was walled off. You weren't allowed through a lot of this stuff. Wow, look at all that. It's like tech structures and everything, and down there, I assume, is very radioactive stuff that you just don't want to mess with. Leads into a giant fissure, actually. Okay, that... Okay, all right. I'm, I'm figuring some of this stuff out. Now, I don't think I can actually go up through here. Maybe I can. So, first things first, we are taking a look at the Rock Drake. Now, I'm at a boss summoning portal, and I'm trying to get the artifacts right now because I want to check out what the Aberration boss is. Apparently, it's a familiar one, but not too familiar. So... I, uh, I will have to check back on that in a little bit, I guess. But I want to check out the Rock Drake. I want to tell you guys how you actually tame this bad Aya. Because I don't want to get demonetized creature. And then I guess we'll check out some of the stuff. So it has an awesome glide. And it seems like the glide has been refined even more since the stream. And it reminds me of, like, the Griffin where you can do this and move in, like, wavy motions. But you will eventually land down. Now, we do see some, uh actual rock drakes over right here but what we're looking for is their eggs you need the rock drake eggs in order to actually get one of these you can't tame them by normal means you actually need to get the egg as it's fertilized just like wyverns basically now this stuff right here too it's a really dangerous substance don't go in it it hurts it hurts really bad just trust me on that okay i've already lost my character on one of the thingies because it was a bad time now i have never even seen these eggs yet and i don't know what they look like for all i know that could be an egg right there no it's not and neither is that so where you would find these i mean i'm assuming i would find them around anywhere in this area because it seems to be the rock drake area let me just see huh. just glide over oh oh that's okay 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 that's that's okay let me just infinite statue you real quick so we don't have to go through that crap again no, thank you. Actually, is what is that right there? What the hell is this? Oh, black pearls. Oh, guys, can you not fight? Please and thank you. Come on, stop fighting. Stop fighting. Stop, stop, stop it. Stop it. There, damn, that was annoying. So, as I was saying before I was rudely interrupted, we need to find the eggs. I'm not exactly sure where we could find the eggs, and I doubt they're perched up very high from us and from sight now i did find black pearls down here so that's right off the bat you know there's a good resource down here that you can find fairly easily actually uh, granted this is a radiation zone normally i'd be taking radiation damage right now i'm 99.5 percent sure but i'm in infinite stats mode so i don't even need to worry about that now i don't really see much of anything around here this place is actually very very pretty let me just infinite stats so i don't have the red around my screen anymore yeah this place is really nice looking we have more of this stuff down right here all right, that's actually pretty cool, but my question is, where will I find an egg? I guess I just have to look for, like, a more obvious nest. And I would like to get outside the map, too, just to see what is outside waiting for me. Now, maybe up right here we'll find one. Let me just take a look-see. Now, if I was a rock drake egg, where would I be? Maybe inside this giant carcass. Goddamn, what is this thing? Looks like a Giga or 
a wreck skull or something. Something massive in there anyways. I know that for a fact. But wait, what's that up right there? Hang on a second, because I see something really weird right here. Now, what are you? Because you look like you could be some fancy stuff, or you might just be some red crystal. That means absolutely nothing to me. Like I had suspected all along. I wasn't I wasn't tricked. I, I swear I was. I, I don't ever get tricked. You guys give me a second, I guess, and I'll try and find this egg. So I think I've actually found one. Hold the phone. Yes, this is one right there. Let me just fly real quick and take a look wow that thing looks beautiful a rock drake egg okay then i guess you grab that sucker right there and then from there you would have to put it somewhere warm or cold and i also assume once you do that and steal that egg it's gonna be a bad time for you because uh 99 chance everything and anything is going to attack you so inside this giant cave system you'll find the eggs are going to be in the walls Contrary to what I had actually thought, and I guess that means you have to fly, or you're going to have to, like, climb walls with uh, with the hooks and stuff like that to actually get any of the eggs. And I don't know how rare they are, so you might be up bone town without, uh, without having the proper equipment to actually find this stuff, because uh, they might be pretty rare. Not sure. It took me about 20 minutes to find that one egg. I'll have to see exactly what the deal is now I, I imagine from there then you would incubate it and there's nothing too fancy so i'm not actually going to go ahead and, and try and incubate the egg or anything like that because that's probably just useless nonsense so to tame a rock drake for those of you wondering you just go ahead and you go down into this really far area that's actually by the boss summoning spot and find the eggs in the walls and then hatch them like a normal wyvern i would assume i don't know if you need wyvern milk or, well, rock drake milk in this instance, but you all know how to get that anyways. Uh, it would probably be the same mechanic as um, in Scorched Earth when you would go ahead and just do your stuff with the wyvern. I mean, it was pretty pretty straightforward as far as I'm concerned. Now, what I want to do is I kind of want to explore this cave system because this place looks gorgeous, but I also want to leave. I want to get out, and I... Oh, what is that? Wow, this place looks... Wow, what the hell? What's up with all this, like... Derelict just destroyed structure stuff. Look at that. What is this giant structure right here? What is this? What is this a spawn zone? This looks like a spawn zone. Because I know these portals. This is a spawn portal zone, I think. Because this is where you're supposed to spawn. You can see the aberration creatures then actually spawning in right there with some beautiful stuff. That's a tech replicator that I had right there because I wanted to make a crazy weapon that I had seen. A tech rifle thingy. Let me show you real quick. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, I got to give Engrams. Wanted to make this, the tech railgun, but unfortunately it doesn't... I can't actually spawn in all the materials for it because you need some weird goop stuff that you just... I don't have the spawn code for it. So I'm going to have to wait and see what happens with that. And hopefully I'll be able to show you guys what that is later. But I'm going to move out of this place and we're going to go to the surface of Aberration because I want to know what's up here. Now there's a chance I could die. And that chance is very likely actually because I do know there's a kill zone. But I do see a something up right there. What is what is that? Is that the aberration sh or is that the ship from the ending of the game? Or maybe that's a broken pillar. I don't know. That's really weird. That is some really weird stuff. Hang on. Let me see if I can look around. Because the area I'm in right now, I know there is a way to get onto the surface. Because I saw it in the trailer. Now... How you do that, I'm not sure. I know this area isn't a surface area because there's a barrier there. I'm not supposed to be up here right now. I'm surprised I haven't died, actually, to be honest with you, because I should have. This area here isn't it either, because we have some weird rock. But there is a... Okay. 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 All right. This is the surface of aberration right here. This is what it looks like. Okay. Let me just slow-mo one so we don't have that... Wow, everything's on fire. Everything is on fire up here. This place is inhospitable. You cannot survive up here. There's just no such thing as surviving. No, it just does not happen. You got supply drops up here, which is good. We have an obelisk up here too, which I assume does the same basic functions as any other arc obelisk. We have some weird stuff going on down right here. Now, you do need some kind of protection. You need protection for radiation because of the sun or the planet or something happened with the ozone layer, I assume. 
I don't see any creatures alive up here. That's one thing that's surprising me. I see nothing that's surviving up here right now. And that's actually a kind of a shocking thing for me. And I don't even know where I would go to see where exactly you get in to the, or get out here. Because there's this one obelisk right here. I mean, I could check it out. Oh yeah, see, that's hurting. There, I'll turn that off. So that should be good. Let me just see what this obelisk has to offer because I'm kind of curious to see if this will bring me to anything relevant to my interest right now. Structures, crafting, no, it doesn't do anything for you. Okay, so automatically we know god mode off, you take fire damage, you just automatically, no matter what, take damage. I do know anything up to tech can be damaged out here. You don't want to mess around with any of this stuff. That is for sure. And I don't, it doesn't really seem like there's too much up here. Oh, we have something surviving up here. What they are, I don't know. Like little wyvern bats. What are these? What are you? You're a seeker. Okay, so seekers survive up here. I don't know if they're hostile or not. Probably not the most hostile creature in the world. They don't look that threatening. A lot of fire down here, though. I'm not liking seeing all this. And it's probably hell on my bit rate. Now, I want to know what you guys think in the comment section below of the surface of aberration because this is something we have not actually seen yet. And I've actually been really excited to see this. I've been questioning what's up here since we found out we could go up here. Since aberration really had any speculation or anything. What's this down here? Oh, this leads down into a different zone. Oh, it gets really bright. Oh god, it's blindingly bright. Is this, a is this a place I shouldn't be able to go? Wow, why is it so bright here? This must be getting more and more dangerous the further we go in. Oh yeah, look at that. Like, you need some serious health. There's metal nodes up here, though. We got a thing we can climb right here. Apparently, I want to go the opposite direction. Don't mind me. I just don't know my direction. So, uh... What is all this? Oh, my God. You can't see in front of you at all. I'm expecting to see, like, maybe a Reaper Queen or something up here. That'd be kind of cool. Or some crazy boss creature. More of those things are surviving up here. Okay, we have more of these rocks. This seems to be the end of it. Yeah, everything changes here. Everything is very messed up and just not okay. So then, the surface of aberration doesn't seem like it's very big. Which doesn't surprise me. I didn't expect it to be a very big zone. It's very bright too. But I think that's all that it has to offer, to be honest with you. Yeah, like that seems to be all. I'm up here now looking around. More dangerous over there than what it is over here. That's for sure. But otherwise, there's nothing really too cool down here. I don't think. What's this? Oh. Oh, what was that? What was... What? Hang on. I just saw a thingy. A thingy thingy. I bet. Oh, yeah. It's, it's crawling around down there, I think. Oh, there's an earthquake, I think. Okay, yeah, and then this must be... Okay, so then there's a reaper something right here. Whatever one you are, I don't know, but I think I can hit you. Yeah, I just hit you out. That's the reaper queen right there. Now, this thing can actually impregnate you. And it's a really messed up situation when you get hit by this thing, actually. Let me just see if I can do anything to you, but I don't think I actually have the power to take this thing down on my own. Now, I could... I'm going to force tame it. That's what I want to do. I'm going to force tame it because I'll never kill it. So let's see. The Reaper Queen has stats. 6,500 health. So that's pretty considerable. I think that's pretty decent.
All right, so then that's that's pretty straightforward than in standard. Oh, and there's another one right here. Wait a sec. Why are there so many of them? Why are you here too? I don't understand why this is a thing. I mean, if you want to mess with me, we can mess around. But I mean, at the end of the day, this ends badly for you. So this area must be some kind of queen layer or something, or maybe there's multiple queens around here. You just see, if I see another one, then I know this is a dangerous area filled with queens. Yeah, there's another one right there. This must be some kind of mutated Rex grounds or some crap. That's what this is. Wow. So then you definitely don't want to mess around with this zone because Reaper Queens are everywhere. Oh, there's a Spino down here. Hi, Mr. Spino. Do you stand up against the Reaper Queen? wonder if you do. You probably... No, no. You don't stand a chance. Okay, so they did listen. There's another one over right there? No, never mind. That's not... That's not one I thought that was. Can I jump? Oh, no. I... Okay, I'm falling through the ground. That's cool, I guess. Didn't need to, you know, do more stuff anyways. Thanks. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. Thanks for that, Reaper Queen. I, I appreciate that, man. It's pretty cool of you to kick me off. Really, yeah, stuff and things and yeah, that stuff. All right, let's move down through here. Yeah, this water is really dangerous for you to step in. Actually, I don't know if it hurts the Reaper Queen. Yes, it does, apparently. Oh, there's things in the water too, I think. What's in the water? Is, is there really... Really? There's a thing in the water. No way. I wouldn't have thought these things could survive in here. That is so weird. Oh, hi. Hi. Okay, you guys go in water too. But anyways, guys, I'm going to end the video right there. We now know the location of the final boss of Aberration. We know how to get Rock Wyvern or Rock Wyvern. Rock Drake eggs. I almost messed it up so bad. I was almost disappointed myself. And we now know where the Reaper Queens actually spawn. I'm going to move into some other stuff in another video. But guys, if you did enjoy this video, well, then leave a like for more. Remember to join my Arc Aberration server, and I will see you in the next video. <clears throat>